check it out, soon. Check it out. Now, there's a huge difference between being hard on thoughts and just being flat out abusive to women. All right. Now, uh, there's a chick who's now suing Trey Songs for 50 grand. She claims that Trey Songs, and by the way, again, l- let me just report the facts. Okay, this is what she's doing. She's suing for 50 grand because she claims that she bought tickets to meet Trey Songs in a VIP area at a strip club called Vanity Grand Cabaret. Okay, she's claiming when she was up in a goddamn strip club in this VIP like area where she was supposed to meet uh, Trey Songs, Trey Songs was belligerent hostile, disrespectful, and clearly did not want pictures taken of him because when she tried to take a picture of him, which later happened in the parking lot, he attacked her viciously, smacking her phone out of her hand and into her face, and according to her, her glasses was broke. Okay? She wants 50 grand for this. Now, I got to keep it 100, man. I got to hear the other side. I can't even lie to y'all, man. Now, this sounds disgusting. This sounds really on some chauvinistic pig type of behavior. But I got to hear this other side because Trey Songs is a performer who is paid to come and entertain. If you're getting paid to entertain women in a VIP area at some strip club, I don't expect you to be stripping, but I expect you to be nice to the people who are coming there. So this whole story sounds bizarre. Did that woman do something to provoke Trey Songs, Or maybe she didn't. Or maybe Trey Songs was in a bad mood from some other shit. Sometimes we see with performers, they get to a venue, they didn't get paid the amount that they're supposed to get paid. Sometimes they don't show up on stage to perform and people think it's the entertainer, but it's other things that's happening in the background. Now, I'm not co-signing if this is true. There's never reason to be mad or mean to your fans. The fans are who make you you. But this whole story sounds wild. And by the way, if you've ever seen a Trey Songs concert, just go on YouTube, Google a Trey Songs concert. These women, okay, these women be like really, they're sexually assaulting that nigga, okay? They're grabbing dick balls, they're grabbing crotch, they're doing everything. They're burying their faces in that niggas. Yo, these chicks be wilding out. So who knows what they may have done, okay? And again, I'm not accusing either or of doing whatever. I'm just saying we got to take a second and hear the other side because too often nowadays, and we've been seeing a lot of reports popping up left and right, we don't even wait for the other side. It's like, fuck him, he's guilty, okay? We're going to give him the benefit of the doubt, but I could definitely categorically say this ain't got nothing to do with hard on thoughts. This is just some random bullshit, okay? Get a comment box, Jackie Demix. You think Trey did it, bruh? You let me know in the comment section. Oh!